Stanley Ogden. I'm sorry, I can't help you. Uh, fattish. Well, not exactly fattish. M yeah, I suppose you could say fattish. Please, go back and sit down. He's got a round face. I wish I could help you. He's me husband. Where is he? Hello, Mrs oh, Ogden. I wonder if you could perhaps persuade him. Come and sit down, Hilda. Yep. Um, funny. I'll try and find out from the office. Funny saying husband, isn't it? You know, I mean, the word husband itself, like, cos, well, it's Stan to me, really, isn't it? Husband's like something you read in the evening news. It's when you're talking to strangers. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, well, come and sit down, Hilda. Look, there's a seat on you here. Got a nice piece of ham for when we get home, lovely and lean. <laughs> Jack likes a little cold ham with some pickles, though it does give him indigestion. <laughs> I asked Floyd Lindley to save some for me. Good gracious. Floyd Lindley? Why did I say that? Uh, how is, um, your husband? <clears throat> Jack? Oh, he'll have some excuse, you mark my words. <laughs> is he, um... Is he all right? Should never have gone looking for Lucille, not at night. Don't know where my husband is, neither. Asked her over there, but she wouldn't tell me. Blooming toffee knows I could report her, I could. Nurse. I can't wait here. We must get back for opening time. Where's Jack? Oh, they won't let you go, Mrs Walker. Now, don't worry. I, I expect your husband's with my husband somewhere. You know what husbands are. Oh, nurse, nurse, nurse! Oh, she's fainted. Yes, nurse, she's fainted. Porter, bring a wheelchair. What on earth were you thinking of, nurse, to keep this old lady sitting here? She should have been seen to immediately. She wouldn't let me, sister. Wouldn't let you? What do you mean, wouldn't let you? She insisted on being seen to last. Nurse, when will you learn not to let old ladies bully you? I'll take her up to W2 and put her to bed. I'll inform Dr. Aiken. Uh, sister. Yes? Uh, could I have some information? I've got a little girl in there, pulled a pan of boiling fat down on herself. I'm very busy. I've been ignorant in these places. It's all right, Hilda. And Mrs. Walker. Jack's all right, and Stan. They're all right. Ah, Stan. Mr. Walker's in X-ray. And Mr. Ogden's in Ward M1. Dad. I tell you what, I'll, I'll go and find us a nice cup of tea from somewhere. Eh? Hmm? Oh, yes, please. Yeah. Mrs. Ogden? Yes, Mrs. Walker. You and I? We've always been friends, really, haven't we, more than employer and employee? Yeah, that's right. I expect it'll be in cardboard cups. Are you are you feeling all right, Elsie? It's a bit chilly outside. Of course, I suppose we can expect it in November. It's warm in here, though, of course, with it being a hospital. 